This is Matthew from the Windows Club. If the Windows 11 taskbar is not working on your system, then either read through this article on the website or simply watch this video. We will guide you through the resolution. The first solution is simply to reboot your system. The second solution would be to restart Windows Explorer. Search for Task Manager in the Windows search bar. When the app appears in the search results, you can click on it to open the Task Manager. Please expand the window. Then, locate the Windows Explorer process. Right-click on the Windows Explorer process and select Restart. The third solution is to reset Windows 11 Taskbar. This has been explained over a separate article and video. The fourth solution is to run an SFC scan. Search for Command Prompt in the Windows search bar and select Run as Administrator in the right pane to open the Elevated Command Prompt window. In the Elevated Command Prompt window, type the command SFC space forward slash scan now and hit Enter to invoke the SFC scan. Reboot the system once the scan is completed. The fifth solution is a registry level fix. Press the Windows key and the R button together to open the Run window. In the Run window, type the command REGEDIT and hit Enter to open the Registry Editor window. Then go to the following path H key underscore current underscore user software. Microsoft, Windows, Current Version, Explorer, Advanced. In the right pane, right click in the open space. From this menu, select New and then from the further drop down menu, click on D Word 32 bit. An entry will be created. Right click on this newly created entry and select Rename. Copy and paste the name Enable XAML Start Menu from the article on the website. Hit Enter to save the value. Double click on Enable XAML Start Menu to open its properties. Change the value of the value data to 0. Click on OK to save the settings. Lastly, if everything else fails, you can consider a system restore or resetting the operating system. Isn't this easy and interesting? If you have any doubts, please go to the original article on the Windows Club and write your question. We will surely answer it.